Hey, good morning everybody, Dan here, Boston Red Sox collector extraordinaire, if you will. Uh, Red Sox collector Dan McGraw coming back with a response video for Ken's Cardboard, his 500 subscriber contest. Uh, congratulations, Ken. Um, it's a huge accomplishment that someday, hopefully, I'll be able to hit as well. Um, Ken wanted to know our top 10 autographs. Uh, that we have and I don't know if it's specific to cards or not I have a ton of autographs but I'm gonna stick with cards um, and I have so many that I tried to kind of really quickly pick out 10 of my favorites these might not be my 10 absolute favorites but they're right up there on the list so hopefully that's okay um, I'm gonna just go ahead and start showing them now start off with a couple of cards if you will these are Perez Steel autograph cards um, I love these autographs. This one is of Hall of Famer Bobby Doerr. And this one is of Hall of Famer Kyle Yastrzemski. Love these cards. Love them plain, love them autographed, love them any which way you can get them. And then this is a card I've showed before um, on my some of my videos. This was a 2017, I believe, uh, Heritage Buyback autograph numbered 53 of 67. It's the red ink version of Carl Yastrzemski. Got this in a trade for a one of one Juan Soto that I pulled out of a one individual pack I bought at Walmart. Um, picked this up along with a 58 Topps All-Star Ted Williams card and there was also another vintage card that I picked up in that trade as well. I don't remember what it was but this one was a trade pickup. That is probably one of my favorites if not my favorite. Uh, this one is really cool. This is a 2004 playoff absolute memorabilia Jason Veritek. I've had this one for a long time. Very cool card. have several Veritek's, but this is probably my favorite one of Veritek. This one is a card I owned years ago, sold it, and then picked one back up. This is from 2000, let's see, I think this is 2002. These are really hard to read. Uh, let's see, 2001, this was a Topps Archives Dom DiMaggio. I love the 52 Topps set, and that's a, such a sweet autograph on card. Uh, like I said, I own this card, uh, I sold it, and then I picked up another one. Uh, probably in the last year, year and a half, I picked this one up. Definitely one of my favorites. And this one, can't have a Red Sox autograph video without a no ma. Uh, this is a... Is that triple threads? My goodness, I'm terrible with all these newer issues. Yeah, that is triple threads. I think that's 15. 2014 triple threads. Nomar with a piece of jersey on it. This one is numbered to 99. It's number 9 of 99. Love that Nomar signature on there. I've got several Nomars also. It's probably my favorite Nomar. And then this one is a Topps Tribute, a green version of Carlton Fisk, Hall of Famer. That one is also numbered to 99. Oh, is that 99 of 99? Never noticed that. Yeah. Uh, geez, it's either 89 or 99. It's 89 of 99. Thought I had a, a 99 of 99 there, but it's 89 of 99. Love me Carlton Fisk autographs. And this one right here, uh, another one of my favorites. This is from 2003, Sweet Spot Classic. White Evans. I love these uh, stitch autographs on the baseballs. These are really cool. Um, when I pulled this out is when I realized I still don't have it in a mag holder, so I gotta pick up a mag holder for this. I'm about 25 or 30 mag holders behind. I have not been buying any uh, during COVID. Um, hopefully my hobby shop still has some. Very cool card there. And then this one, one I picked up during the off season of 2018. This is an 18 Topps Inception Purple Raphael Devers. Very nice card. This one's a low serial number. This one's 45 of 75. A uh, couple different color variations of that card, but very nice Devers card. That's my favorite, Rafi Devers. And the last one I'm going to show is a Jose Canseco. Uh, this is the Bowman's Best. This was redone, I want to say, in 2017. 2016. Bowman's Best, Jose Canseco. Nice looking gold, shimmery kind of card. Um, I have a couple Canseco certifieds, but this is my favorite one of those. Um, so, very cool. 
that's my top 10 autographs. Um, again, not necessarily my 10 absolute favorites. I have about close to 400 on-card autographs, um, certified on-card autographs, so it's hard to pick out just 10. But those are 10 of my favorites. Hopefully I tag this right and I get myself entered in this contest because I did one a few weeks ago and I didn't tag it properly. So uh, hopefully it'll be uh, entered into the contest and to all the participants, good luck to you. Um, I just wanted to get a video in because I've had, I'm have i doing a contest myself and a lot of people have taken the time to do one for me. So that's what my contest entry looks like. Um, and that's all I got. Thanks everybody for watching. Take care.